Hey guys, quick little video on how to remove your TCM from one of these 8HP 90s. All right, well I got everything pretty much free. I'm uh, just figuring stuff out. So this has to come out. You kind of have to pull up this retaining tab. And you have to pull this out in order to get the plug connector out of here. And then there's another sensor there for output shaft speed, which is roasted, but I think she should be free now, finally, and it's out. Here it is. I'm just gonna jump straight into it. It is possible. You have to remove a series of bolts and how you're gonna tell which ones they are. Don't sit there and remove every single bolt off of your valve body. But if you look, you can tell which ones need to be removed because you'll see it them come through the backside here. Some of them are hidden, but most of them you can see. This one is completely grenaded. This valve body has already got chunks out of it, so I'm not too worried about damaging it. Um, but you'll see here, the valve body comes off of the actual uh, transmission by the larger head bolts. So there's a smaller Torx, but you'll see a larger one. I end up using a T40 and you'll end up removing all the large Torx. And that's the ones that hold it to the transmission. If I run out here real quick, there's a grenaded 8HP 90, but the ones with the larger Torx are the ones that hold it to the actual transmission itself. So I'll remove all the large Torx and then that will get the valve body off of there. Then once you get to the bench here, you are going to see this. And in order to get this off, you will have to, you'll see this when you remove all the large torques, you'll see this little retainer, pull this out, and it's gonna release the actual plug that goes into your transmission, and then pull that plastic clip out of the transmission so you can get this out. From there, like I said, just look, and you'll see which ones screw into the valve body. All of these solenoids, it slips off of them. And you'll see this. So this will start to lift straight up. So it'll lift up and you'll see these kind of locating posts here. And you're just gonna lift this whole thing up. And this is your TCM. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to salvage this one because as you can see, we got a sensor broken here and a sensor mauled over here. But this is how you remove it. And that wire goes over there. So there we have it. So the TCM is right there. You can see the brain in the middle, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to salvage this because like I said, it looks like this is all one integral unit. Normally you'd be able to swap this all over if obviously that was good and that was good, but mine is not. So I might be stuck, but that shows you that you can remove your TCM, swap it over to a new transmission if you're doing something like I am. I was hoping I could swap this over, but like I said, that mauled sensor and that one, I think are gonna prevent me from doing that. So if you guys enjoyed this video or found it helpful and informative, make sure you give it a thumbs up, ask any questions down below, check out my videos where I actually grenaded my 8HP90 in this Hellcat Dakota. I'll see you guys in the next video.